what we are going to do is go a little hype beast and finally open up this set that has been sitting in the background of my videos for the last few weeks. It is the Hot Wheels Car Culture Team Transport Supreme set. The collaboration that Hot Wheels did with Supreme, it surprised people when it was first seen, when, when Supreme, Supreme announced it. People thought this was a custom, they thought it was fake. Nonetheless, fast forward a couple months, it is finally out. People bought it a few weeks ago. It sold out in six seconds. I have no idea how many were made. All through Team, uh, I'm sorry, through Supreme. But it, well, like all Supreme products, sold super quick and we won't see it in any other format. Meaning, it's not going to be sold on RLC. It's not going to be sold at retail. This baby is done. Well, I got myself a set and I have been sitting, staring at this, knowing I was going to open it. And I just needed to find the right time. Well, the time is now. But I also wanted to find the right angle. And I thought, oh, I, you know, the angle's really, I'm going to open the darn thing. But there's other thoughts. Could I do collaborations? Well, there has been some very cool, just recently, collaborations. Obviously with car brands, but then we've seen some really new things, cool things like this period correct uh, Mercedes-Benz. That was done, you know, about four or five months ago. And then, of course, the Supreme set. And I'm wondering if this is a sign of things to come. And I absolutely love it. Some people have said, Supreme, why are they doing this? This is the worst thing ever. No, it's not. I will argue and argue and argue that doing these kind of collaborations, while it may not be your cup of tea, is a fantastic opportunity for Hot Wheels. And for us, it's really cool to see that go out. Really, really cool styling, doing the 90s theme with the Deco. Um... Very, very cool set using the BMW E30. Really cool that they did team transport instead of just a, a standard model. I'm all for this. Auto collaborations are great. Hot Wheels should continue to do them. But these fashion collaborations are fantastic as well. But I, it's much easier to use the theme of how cool is team transport. It's only been out for about a year, if not less. And we have seen some super, super cool stuff from, of course, the gassers like the black hole i'm sure we'll see more gassers in the future we've seen a you call it muscle you can also call it hot wheels nostalgic with nostalgia with snake and with mongoose maybe i would that got that wrong yeah snake and mongoose we've seen that we're going to see um i'm sure we're going to see some more muscle related or american car related team transport coming up we've seen some euro obviously two porsches with the momo set and with the uh magnus walker set and then, of course, we've had plenty of JDM. The Falcon uh, Mercedes is coming. That's going to be uh, Euro. And then JDM, of course, with the Advan uh, ha uh, Hakoska Wagon. Of course, the Gretti Laurel, the BRE 510, and the JDM Legends uh, Hakoska. Really, really cool sets. And then we have a 240Z coming as well. And I think, well, I don't want to say something I'm not supposed to, so I can't remember what else was previewed at uh, I'll overlay it with some things what overlay um, previewed at nationals but I think there's some other really cool sets coming team transport has been a success and it is going nowhere and maybe we'll see some other cool things like this all right let's take a look at this set we have seen it you have seen it. a lot of people have opened it. a lot of people have just shown off their sets not much to talk about that I haven't already said nostalgic Hot Wheels logo the Mattel logo which is very very cool um, Hot Wheels logo, right, with the Mattel sign on it from the 90s. The blue card is what uh, us collectors call it, but uh, this font is back from that era. Of course, the real riders, metal, metal, and the car and the car culture team transport logos are all from the current sets. This is the back. I don't think this is going to help anyone because it ain't anywhere. It is only sold at Supreme, or you know, it's sold out in six seconds, I believe. So this set, in terms of being available, is only available in the secondary market, and that is how it will remain. A little silhouette there feature, and we just need to open it. Should we do it? Let's do it. Well, what do you think? Here it is. I'm looking at it out of the package for the first time. Noticing all the details from the model itself. So it's world famous on the back, of course. A super cool model. 
I like this. I've always liked this casting. I think it's well done. And I like this version as well. Some people don't like the fact that the grill is not colored in. I get that. But I still think this model looks fantastic. I'll do an E30 showcase one of these days. Supreme will obviously be part of that. Love it with these wheels, by the way. I just think it works. It just works. 90s era cars are going to be the thing with Hot Wheels moving forward because they are the thing with car culture right now. So this BMW fits right in. Super, super cool set. If you're willing to pay a few dollars to get a secondary, I think it's totally worth it. All right, guys, that is your showcase today. The Supreme Team Transport, it has been opened. Blister, card, looks good. Always looks good with a good rip on it, right? It's going to stay with me. I'm done. Let's take a look at some of these Team Transport. What a cool line it is. Bye.